Welcome back, guys. Um, so as you may remember uh, from my first video, this is part two of my Winter Wonderland um, art journaling slash junk journaling uh, series. So this is the uh, box um, that I made in the previous video. If you did miss that, I'll pop the link in the description for you. So I wanted to show you the next part. So if I open this up, we can see what I've done is I've stuck down um, a ready-made journal just um, to save a little bit of time and I had this one uh, lying around for ages and I wanted to use it and it fits really really well in here and it's also one which is double-sided so it gives me lots and lots of space to be creative so what I thought I'd do is show you um, some of the ways that you can uh, begin thinking about decorating front covers for journals. So I've got some bits and pieces here um, that I've had from various different things. I thought I'd talk you through them. So um, I always sort of go through any old magazines and newspapers to see if there's any quotes or words I like and then I keep those, I cut them out. Um, this is literally just um, a I believe this was actually from a um, shopping bag from a gift shop I think and I just sort of liked um, this sort of drawing type style that was on it um, quite sort of earthy um, so I thought I would use that and uh, this is a cutout from a box of uh, turmeric tea as you can see this is actually the little packet that the tea bag came in so I'm going to use this as a little sort of pocket to uh, pop things in and again this was just um, a piece of paper that I had so one of the things um, that I really do recommend that might be quite helpful is when you're looking through the bits and pieces you've got see if you can find like a colour theme so all of the bits that I've managed to find because I started off with this one first and I thought okay so I want to look for things that may be sort of quite pastel tones maybe some greens maybe some pinks and then I found that and I thought, oh, well, that might work. And then uh, sort of these as well. And then I thought maybe that could go there or up here or something. Um, so it just sort of gives you a bit of an idea on uh, colours um, that you can use. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start to sort of play around with this, find a combination that I like. I'm going to stick some things down, maybe outline some things, maybe put some um, embellishments on here. Um, so I will then come back to the camera so you can see that process.
Hi everybody, so uh, basically I've stuck some of these bits and pieces down. Um, as you can see I've made like a mini tag here um, and I've just put a teeny tiny little peg on there as well. And I've also edged it with a little bit of um, sort of uh, card edging just to give it a little bit of glitz. And in here I've done my first page. So again sort of keeping with the colour theme. Uh, this here was um, actually from a uh, box which had some makeup in it so I just cut up uh, the box because I quite liked um, this sort of pattern um, that was on sort of the edges of it so I thought oh I can keep that and use it um, and again the sort of green and pink from that matched the green and pink um, from the leftover pieces of paper I had um, so I stuck this down as well. This is a little uh, drawing slash painting that I did of a little owl, um, which I did in watercolour and pen. So I stuck that in. I've also got some more um, sort of outlining um, sort of stickers here that I've put around the outside. I've done a little bit of journaling here. And here, um, even though it's, it's uh, struggling to stick down, is a mini envelope, which I may put something in. And I've just been uh, drawing some holly uh, around the outside of this as well. Um, so yeah, this is sort of the start of my first page in this uh, Winter Wonderland journal. And again, uh, this is sort of the uh, front of it, sort of looking at things that, um, you know, you might start to see um, in sort of late autumn, early winter, when sort of the, the leaves of the trees are changing. So sort of that kind of earthy, um, nature feel to this front page and turmeric tea again um, really sort of uh, refreshing for this time of year and uh, ginger which was also um, in uh, some of these uh, sort of herbal teas that you um, sort of tend to drink this time of year as well when it starts to get colder so I thought this might work quite well so uh, yeah this is the front cover and uh, the first page in this journal at the moment. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope it's given you some ideas on some of the things that you can sort of use up and use from sort of old packaging boxes, um, all sorts of things uh, that you can use uh, just from things you can find lying around the house. Um, please do uh, keep it here for part three, which will be coming up uh, very soon. And also check out my other videos as well. I've got all sorts uh, on my channel. Um, I've also started to do uh, some drawing and painting um, tutorials on here as well so please do check them out if you haven't already please do like and subscribe to my channel I really appreciate it and uh, I will see you soon for my next video